Here we are, ladies and gentlemen, bathrooms across America, returning to your screens. Um, I'm out on the road with Rodney Crowell. Um, he's got a new album out called Triage, which is really, really great. Um, I suggest that you get it. And we have a great uh, band um, that we're touring with. We've got Catherine Marks on piano, Glenn Karuba on the percussion, and Zachariah Hickman on the bass. Um, so please come out and see us sometime if we're uh, in your neck of the woods. Currently we are in Fayetteville, Arkansas, as, or as I used to call it in England, um, Arkansas. No, it's Arkansas. So um, we're staying at this hotel called The Graduate. Okay, it is a sort of collegiate themed um, chain of hotels in England and in America, reflecting the colours and traditions and history of the local college. So we are in uh, Fayetteville, and I'm really in, I'm kind of in two minds with this, this whole hotel experience, because on one hand, it's got a, you know, a very large lobby, which was great, which was handy because we had to wait in there for about three hours before we got our rooms this morning. Um, it's got a nice fitness room. Those are all good things, those are positive things. This bathroom has got some interesting choices. Buck Rogers, I think that's Buck Rogers, am I wrong? I think it is. Okay, that's kind of cool, I like that. It's got a shower curtain and not half a shower door. We know that uh, makes me happy. Uh, the obligatory um, hipster uh, bathroom rum conditioner, cilantro, shampoo and all that uh, nonsense. Okay, interesting. However, we go into this room and this is where I'm really sort of grappling the horns of a, di of a dilemma in my um, review because this bathroom is great but this uh, this bedroom rather is I mean what do you call that it's like what's going on here I mean these all these colors um, it's like it's kind of too much and it, if anything it reminds me of a sort of a Wes Anderson movie set except if um, you know if someone vomited up a, a, a Wes Anderson movie set this is what it might look like um, it's kind of cool, but should it all be together? Should this uh, carpet be next to these curtains? I don't think so. The curtains do not match the carpet. We know that that is not a good thing. Um, I'm sorry for that poor joke. Uh, this thing is what tips the balance for me. It's kind of scary. I don't know what that's doing on the wall. It's kind of this cloth. What is that? Is it a boar? Uh, it's kind of odd um, and then that piece of art it's just it's a barcode uh, and so anyway one last look at it it's I mean it's cool they spent a lot of money on it but it doesn't make me want to stay here for more than like 20 minutes and also I'm just going to throw this in here it's really dirty in here look at that it says we have taken extra steps to clean I don't think they have I need to maybe address that. So, uh, you know, in conclusion here of this review, I hope I haven't gone on too long here. Um, it's, it's good, they've spent some money on it, but I'm afraid I'm gonna have to give it a 6.9 because it, I just don't wanna stay here. It's, it, I just don't wanna stay here. So thankfully we're leaving tonight, we're going back to Nashville. So um, for anyone in Nashville, I'll see you back there. Until then, bathrooms across America. Thankfully we got this in because the whole week has been great, just very nice sort of bland hotels, but this one is worthy of review. So um, I'm glad we did it. Okay, see you, bye.